Hi guys, my name is Sheridan, and this week I am filling in for Megan. Don't know where she is. Little scallywag, avoiding making a video. Avoiding Dare Week. Yeah, so this week is Dare Week on See More Than Me. And uh, my dare, fairly easy, will teach you how to make a simple, healthy meal. Now, a lot of people think that it's very difficult to make something healthy and delicious, and that's where you're wrong. I'm going to teach you how to make a superb cuisine using nothing but foods lying around your house. Here we go. You will need bread, man's oldest food, olives, just to get that healthy Greek twist, hot chilies, delicious, and they boost your metabolism, some orange juice for vitamin C, Barbecue sauce, the taste of summer, milk, gotta get your calcium, Hellman's real mayonnaise, a raw egg, French's all-American mustard, free from artificial flavors and preservatives, lemon juice, mmm, some tuna, gotta get that omega-3 in you, cream of tomato soup, mmm, 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 nice and healthy, and super noodles, cause why the hell not? So first of all, what you're gonna wanna do is take your egg, just crack it in there, Nice and professional like. You know what? For added calcium, throw in the shells. There we go. Mmm. After that, we you need just one or two olives. One, two, three, four, five. Get a little bit of that uh, flavor in there. Yeah, look at that. Okay, not too much now. You don't want it to taste disgusting. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That is looking good. If I do say so myself, open this freaking jar of uh, Hot peppers. No, not too many. You want it to be nice. It's very hard to make something spicy and delicious. Three, two, three. I think four is enough. Then you want to take a mayonnaise, just a tablespoon amount. Mmm, so good. Yeah. Keep whisking. Now, when you add the orange juice, you only want to add about uh, however much you want. Just add a little bit of mustard. I keep whisking it the whole way through. Ah, oh, if you could just smell that now. That is delicious. Then you just want a little dollop of barbecue sauce. Barbecue! Then you want to take a tin of tuna. Uh, you don't have to worry about a half a tin or certain amounts. The thing I really love about this recipe is that you don't have to worry about exact measurements. It just tastes delicious no matter how much of what you use. Um, then you want to get your tuna. Squeeze out all the juices in there. Uh huh. The thing I love especially about this meal is it's so simple to make. Perfect for second dates, you know, when uh, you invite your date over to your house and you want to prepare them something nice to eat and you never know what. This is a meal that everyone can enjoy, unless you have allergies, of course. But not a lot of people have allergies to the ingredients that we have used today. Bonus. You don't want to use a lot of noodles, just maybe about a third to a half. Then you're going to take the sachet, just empty the whole thing in there. Okay, so that should be enough. Mmm, the aroma. So delicious, so healthy. And for the culinary adventurous, to add a little more seasoning, you know, you can add a couple of spices, maybe some aquarium fish food. Just might do the trick. Just a pinch. Yeah. There we go. Mm -mm. So then what you want to do next, you just want to slap this in the microwave for about a minute. And now the last step is enjoy. Mm. It's like a battle of flavor in my mouth, that's really, really something. If you enjoy, you can dunk your bread in it. Mmm, mm-hmm. So good. Oh. oh, some needles this time. Some eggshell in there. Put some, is that, is that tuna? Mmm, -hmm. delicious. Even tastes good coming up. 
It must be the orange. I can still taste that um egg. Is this seriously what my life has become? I think I'll have some more bread. That's one thing I don't like about this food. When the bread goes soggy. No more for me, thanks. I'm alright. So thank you guys for watching, I'm Sheridan Hackland. I hope you enjoyed this video. Watch it, like it, favourite, comment, pass it on, and subscribe to see more than me. And, uh... Yeah. See you guys later. Ooh! That's it. I'm done. I'm done. I think it wouldn't have tasted so bad if I didn't use all that olive juice, but other than that, it's fine. You're probably wondering, hey, Sheridan, what was the milk for? Milk's to wash it all down.